welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my first ever video. I really have no idea how this is going to go. This is about my fifth time trying to start by just saying hi. So yeah, hopefully my channel is going to be full of like clothing hauls and makeup and hair tutorials if that's something people would want to see. Maybe just some chatty videos. But I thought today I would start with a haul because they're my favourite videos to watch and I've gone really crazy, like really quite bad. Um, and I'm actually going to have to split the haul into two because I got everything out and I was like, oh, I'll have a few bits to show. And it turned out that I got more stuff in H&M on its own than I did of everything. So I'm going to do a haul now on like... Primark, Topshop, Urban Outfitters, ASOS and then do a second haul just purely on H&M. So I'm just going to get started. Um, I got two tops in Brandy Melville. So firstly I got this one here and the material of these is so so soft. They're just mm. um, and I love a stripe and it's just a basic tee. They're they seem to just be one size fits all, which, I don't know, is a bit baffling. But there we are. So that's that, and it's just like navy blue um, around the collar and around the arms. And it's not cropped, but it sits just where your jeans come up to, so it's really nice. Because it's not like a long baggy t-shirt, but then it's not like cropped. You don't have to wear it with high-waisted stuff, so I really like it. And I think this was... 15 euro and um, also I picked up this one which the label it was actually like this when I bought it and I meant to stitch it back on but I just didn't um, and this is the same kind of thing it's like not cropped but it's it's just a good length if you wear it with jeans because it just comes right where your jeans go so it's really nice and that one's a, that was a one size one as well um, and yeah, just stripes. I just love stripes. They're just easy to wear. So that was from Bandy Melville. Again, this was like 18 euro, I think. Next, I have my Primark stuff. So I was in Primark the other day. And I've recently dyed my hair blue. This has only been in the last like two weeks or something. And I've wanted to do it for a while, like do a kind of different colour, but I wasn't sure which colour to go for. Anyway, I went for this like peacock blue it's called and I didn't realise how difficult it would be to like find clothes to go with it. Like I just didn't consider that I might not be able to wear some colours anymore. So it just means that I have to be a bit careful with what I go for. So anyway, when I was in Primark I saw this t-shirt and it's just I think it's so mermaidy and just pretty and I thought the greeny colour would go really nicely with my hair. I don't know how long I'll keep my hair like this for but for summer I thought, you know, it was good. I thought like, I think it's a glit like a goldy glittery sheen to it um, and it's just quite like loose and it's got these rolled up sleeves and I really like that and I think that'll be good as well like going into autumn winter because you could wear it now with like shorts or a wee skirt. But then also it would be nice with like dark jeans or like leather trousers. So yeah, and I think that was like £8. Yeah, £8 for that one. And also in Primark I picked up... Just do them up. Preparation is key. These like mum jean shorts and Basically what drew me to them is the fact that they're a bit longer here because last year in Topshop I picked up the like cut off denim shorts and I really like them from the front but from the back it's just like bum and I really just didn't feel comfortable like every time I was out I felt like I had to cover it up or I was like pulling them down and um, that's them at the back. So like your bum would probably come to like here. So you've got a, a few inches to cover up the modesty. And they're high waisted. I really couldn't believe these, these are from Primark. And they seem really good quality as well. And they've got like rose gold detailing there. Although they do seem like a bit squint here. 
are they or is that just me? No, they are. They're a different length. But they were ten pound, so oh well. Um, next is something I got off Depop, which if you don't know what Depop is, it's um I think it's a relatively new app, um and it's kind of like eBay except better. Well, it's different because you when you put things up on Depop, you can put how much you want for it, and people can just buy it to wait for like auctions to end and that kind of thing. Anyway, um on Depop, I saw these leather shorts and these were originally from Topshop and they're in really good neck. I think these were £10 I got them for and they're real leather as well and they just fit really nicely like they're high waisted and yeah I really like them on. I've worn them quite a few times. Next I have stuff that I picked up in Urban Outfitters when I was in the other day. Everywhere's got their sales on just now so I got some things. Firstly, these are, some people might not like these and I wasn't sure at first because I feel like I'm in my pyjamas but they're, they're just so comfy. So these are from the cooperative brand that they have in Urban Outfitters and basically they look like this and they're collops so they're like long shorts type deal and they're just baggy and got this really nice print on them. I just really really like them. They look really nice with like a little black crop top and a wee kimono and they're just really like loose and easy to wear so I really like them. I think they were in the sale for £15 instead of like £35. Um, so yeah I got them and then I got these. My babies. These. Yes, these these were down to £30 because they're just really, really comfy. So I'm loving them. I'm really glad that I found them. Next up, I have some top shopping bits. So firstly, are these white jeans. I was looking all over for white jeans. Nothing was looking right. Like some of them were a bit see-through and some of them were just clinging all wrong and I was just like, whoa. But then... <laughs> in Topshop. It did take me like a few trips trying on a few different pairs before I found these. But you know when you just put on a pair of jeans and you just think, yes. Like I hadn't even seen them but they just felt right. Like they didn't feel too tight anywhere and they just felt... Mm. So this is them. They are, they are the Jamie jeans. So this is them here. And um, yeah, they just have the ripped knee and they're like stretchy and quite high waisted, not as high waisted as the Joni jeans, but they're like a thicker material, so they're not see-through at all, which is really good. That's them, I'm really happy I found them. And I also picked up this bralette. It's kind of paisley print or like those china plates you get. It'd be nice with the white jeans. Um, next up are these trousers, which I actually got for an interview, but I've been wearing them so much since. Um, it's these black trousers, so they're kind of like, I don't know if you can see. They have like draped material down the front here, and then they have pockets. Okay. And they go in at the bottom, and then they have like cuffed bits down here and they're quite high waisted but they're just really really flattering and they're really easy to wear and they're like a nice breathable material so I'm really loving wearing them. Then in the Topshop sale um, I found this. And I'm loving like Aztec-y prints and stuff just now. I think I'll wear this so much and it's just got a zip up the back there. And this was down to £15 instead of 34 So I just think that'll be really nice, like, even when it gets a bit colder with tights and then, like, a big jumper. So I was happy with that. And then lastly for this haul, you can probably see it lurking in the background, is this backpack. And I really, really, really love this. So I got, I ordered this off ASOS. So it's got gold hardware on the zips. Yeah, it's got this here, but this actually is nothing. That's just like for show. For show. 
on the Lardy. And it's got this front pocket. It's quite spacious actually. <laughs> so I took this on my recent trip to Brighton and it was so handy. Pen out of my bag, which was this bag, because I don't really know how I did it. I managed to do this. So I think there is a method to get that out. I don't really know how. Because it's white. And it's not, it's like, oh, I don't know. So that's really upset me. And I know it's on the back, so you won't see it. But you know when you just know something's there? But anyway, so this is this bag. It was a really good price. They had 20% off on ASOS, so that's when I got it. I think it was only £18 normally, so I think I got it for like £14 something. So that is the end of my haul for today. That's all the stuff that I've collected. But if you guys like this video, please like it and I will leave all my social media links and stuff down below. And if I find links for all this stuff, I'll leave it below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys!